Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, for today's video, I'm going to be trying out some newer um, drugstore products for you guys. If you would like to see how I created this look, go ahead and keep watching. going to start off by going ahead and using the photo focus foundation um, stick and mine is in 848a porcelain and I'm just going to go ahead and um, apply that all over. I hope this is my shade. We'll find out won't we folks. This all over. I'm just going to use my Real Technique sponge. going to go in with the photo focus concealer and this one is I believe it's the light one yeah light ivory 840b light ivory go ahead and apply this I'm going to go in with Wet n Wild uh, Photo Focus, the pressed powder. This one is 821E Warm Light, a uh, Real Techniques powder brush. Just going to kind of set it. Okay. Now I'm going to just take a smaller uh, concealer brush by e.l.f. and I'm just going to set my, my uh, concealer using the same photo focus press powder guys. Just tap that in everywhere. I'm actually going to go in and try the new um, Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow. This is the micro brow pencil and mine is in light brown or soft brown sorry i think it's very comparable to the elf ultra precise the little micro brow pencil that elf has that i've been using lately micro pencil that i use it's definitely a lot darker I just love the fact that it has a spoolie on one end. Can't have a brow pencil without a little spoolie on the end. And of course it has to be a small spoolie, not them ginormous ones that some, they have. Sometimes you're like, really? What am I supposed to do with that? I'm going to apply a little bit of bronzer and I'm going to be trying the Wet n Wild. Um, this is one of the newer ones. This is the Color Icon Bronzer and this one is in Palm Beach Ready. It is a little bit shimmery, um, more shimmery. You could say, you can see that it looks kind of like goldish, um, but that's okay. I don't mind it. I usually go for a matte bronzer, but there are times when I feel like I'm going to go ahead with be a little bit more glowy. So I'm just gonna apply this on my cheek area, on my forehead a little bit. And the brush I'm using, it's basically just an e.l.f. complexion brush. I like it because it's kind of like flatter, um, but it's still big, but you can get more um, a little bit more precise on the cheek area with it because it's a little flatter instead of puffy. And actually, it's not too shimmery. It's kind of more sheen. It's a good color. It's a little bit reddish on me, but not too bad. I hate when I put them on and they're like super red or orange and I'm like, oh, 
this one is not too bad with that. I'm gonna go ahead and apply a little bit of blush. I'm gonna be using the Wet n Wild. This is the color icon. Um, this one is in Fantastic Plastic Pink 329B. And I'm just going to use an e.l.f. angled um, blush brush for this. Just going to tap a little bit in it. And apply. Okay, I think that's good because we are pink enough <laughs> as it is. But I really wanted to go pretty pink today. I don't know why, I just felt really, it's like really girly, really pink today, I don't know. I'm going to apply some um, Ulta. This is the gel eyeliner in blackout. I'm just going to apply that. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and start applying eyeshadow. I'm gonna first go in with um, the NYX Avant Pop um, palette and I'm gonna take this um, kind of skin tone yellowy beige color and I'm gonna use that as my base. I'm just gonna take a wet n wild um, eyeshadow brush. This one's a little bit more fluffy and flat if you can see. Just take a little bit and kind of set my whole eyelid with it. And I'm gonna apply, this is the Essence My Fave Must Haves. They're like individual eyeshadows. This one's in number seven, Mauve Time. I'm just gonna go in with another Wet n Wild. Um, this is just a blending eyeshadow brush. And I'm just gonna apply that all over the crease area and um, a little bit above the crease as well. Now I'm gonna go in with um, ColourPop. Sorry, I took the lid off already. This is a ColourPop um, Super Shock Shadow in Bill. Um, it's another kind of like purpley mauve color. I'm just gonna take the same blending brush. I'm going to go ahead and apply, this is um, a new eyeshadow. It's a um, like cream liquid eyeshadow from Wet n Wild. Um, this one is the Liquid Catsuit Shimmer Liquid Eyeshadow, it's called. And it's in Fairy Tale Ending 576B. And I'm just going to apply that little bit on my eyelid inner. To about mid eyelid here. It's kind of like a purpley, it reminds me of like a mermaid um, because it's kind of like pink and purple but like in certain light when you move it does kind of look bluish as well. I'm gonna leave the V outer V um, open here. Okay, so now that the eyeshadow has um, dried a little bit more, I'm gonna go back into the NYX Avant Pop and I'm going to just pick up this purpley, um, it's more of a kind of glittery shade, but it's kind of got gold flakes in it. And I'm just going to place this in the outer V area and a little into the crease. And I'm gonna take that same purpley shade right here. And I'm just gonna bring it down underneath the lower lash line. So now I'm gonna go ahead and line my lips and I'm going to be using this Wet n Wild Photo Focus. This is one of the gel lip liners. And um, let's see, this one is Bare to Comment and it's number 651B. Okay, 
Okay, now I'm gonna go in with this Essence um, lipstick. This one is in number five, Cool Nude. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply my mascara. I'm gonna be using the um, L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. And uh, mine is in black as black, as usual. Just apply that. done with that I'm gonna go ahead and apply um, highlighter and this is the newer wet n wild this is one of the loose highlighters um, this one is in I'm so lit I'm looking for the name on the bottom it's I'm so lit 396 a and this is like the more um, champagne -y color um, it's not really too pink or anything like that I'm gonna first just apply it with a little fan brush from um, real techniques just gonna tap it in there. Ooh yeah. Um yeah. This one is very super pigmented. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take a um, Elf flat eyeshadow brush, and I'm gonna take some of the um, loose um, highlighter, and I'm just gonna apply it in my inner corner. A little bit and also a little bit in my brow bone right here same thing on the other side that is super pigmented guys super pigmented I think this is going to be one of my f new favorites literally Hope you guys enjoyed getting ready with me and trying out some newer drugstore products with me today. Please don't forget to like and subscribe before leaving and I will see you in my next video. Bye.